Hello everybody, back with another one of these morning thrift store trips and uh, I went to just our favorite Goodwill while I was also out doing other things, went to the gym, that kind of stuff. And I found, first off, a big stack of these Janet Ivanovich hardcover books. Uh, these are just one of those things that sell consistently well for us if we can get a lot of them together. Individually, not worth your time, but well, we save up lots of those and those sell pretty well. On the video game front, I found one strategy guide which we just don't find strategy guides so that's really really cool to find even though it's nothing yeah i'm particularly interested in it'll go up in the store pretty fast halo 4 the complete game guide huge guide for that and this is pretty cool from the 90s x-men one of these 90s x-men uh, picture books and i had a whole bunch of these as a kid i believe amanda did as well this was just such a popular series when we were growing up and then Char Charles Berlitz in Atlantis, the Eighth Continent. Then for music CDs, there were a bunch of movie soundtracks. Speed 2, and these were all like 20 cents. So uh, Pearl Harbor, Batman Begins, Transformers, which one of these? Uh, Revenge of the Fallen. I've only ever seen the first one of these ones, so just... Do not appeal to me. Uh, Lord of the Rings, I looked around if there were two of them there. I couldn't find the third one, but we have the Fellowship of the Ring and Return of the King. So I couldn't find two towers, but those are all there. Uh, those are all pretty much for the store as well. And then same thing with all these VHS, not a whole lot that was there for us. This really, really bizarre looking Woody Woodpecker cover. I've seen him done this way before, uh, but not very frequently. Normally it's a little bit more of a uh, modernized version, but Woody Woodpecker plus other classic cartoons on VHS. Woody Woodpecker Volume 1, so check these out. Magic School Bus in the Rainforest. And Dr. Seuss Hop on Pop plus two more Dr. Seuss classics. Those will be up on the store as well as the white clamshell in decent shape because these are usually cracked and yellowed and things, but the white clamshell version of Space Jam, was Space Jam 2 coming out soon. Figured this was worth grabbing for less than a dollar to put up on the store. Uh, so that was it for one quick trip. Not sure if we'll go back out this weekend or not. Uh, but yeah, so that was, you know, my morning was I got up super early, went to the gym, because uh, I try to get in like once a week, twice if I can, usually once a week, but I was able to do that, get back home, I shower, eat something, and get to Goodwill right as it was opening. Did that, went to the grocery store, all that kind of stuff. Just trying to knock it out of the park today because I have a lot of uh, work to catch up on. Uh, so yeah, that'll be kind of the start to my weekend. Get a lot done here. Over the weekend, I'm going to be playing more of the Valkyria Chronicles 4. Really, really enjoying that. I'm about eight hours in or so, I think, uh, over the past you know, a little over a week. and. I'm loving it. It's fantastic. I'm considering getting the first one. I know the first one um, is considered to still be one of the the best in the series, if not still the best. You know that and four, uh, two and three. I know two was on the PSP and is not as well received, and three was on the PSP in Japan only. Uh, so, but one I'm I'm curious about. I really really like this. So if I finish this and like it as much as I'm enjoying it so far, I might check out one. Um, if you are a fan of that series, I know there's also the Revolution game, but it seems like it's very very different. If you're a fan of that series, let me know. Do you suggest just grabbing the original PlayStation 3 release or the remaster release on the PS4 of the first Valkyria Chronicles game? You know, is are there significant differences, or if I find the PS3 version? You know, dirt cheap, should I just grab that and it's not a huge difference because I have both consoles. So uh, let me know if you are a fan of that series, what you would suggest if you, you know, know both versions pretty well.